What is going on guys and girls? My name is James Orthoxy and welcome back today to Stardew Valley here on Ronald Farms. How are you doing everyone? Welcome back. Today you may notice there is a bit of a difference. What happened to our house? It is huge now. Look at this. This is so cool. So at the end of last episode, we just got ourselves a very fancy schmancy kitchen being built. Well, the good news is it is now done. This is so weird. So I'm completely used to just living in like the little box. And now we've got a second room. So of course, <laughs> let's move this big chubby teddy bear in here. Ah, no place like home. Look at that. Um, so yeah, this is really weird. Uh, I've got a double bed now, which is probably good. Especially if things with Penny go to plan, because she may move in with us, which would be pretty cool. But, uh, yeah, this is awesome. So we can obviously, like, get more rooms and stuff, but we just have to go and pay for them. So we just got to kind of keep with our sort of trying to get some money. Uh, what is this? A tip for your adventurers out there, don't forget your weapon's special attack. Swords can block incoming attacks, which is very useful when slimes are jumping at you. Clubs can pound the ground, sending enemies flying, and a dagger, you can perform a super quick triple strike attack. Be safe! Pretty cool. Look at this. Ooh, so extra storage here, we've got like a fridge, and we actually have a kitchen now. Wow, look at this, so we can actually now craft all of these recipes. So we're missing so many recipes. I like to think I've been pretty good trying to learn them, but... Apparently, we've been rubbish. Tell me about food. God damn you, TV. Ooh, the strawberries are ready. Yes. Oh, this should be really good. So, oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> I learned from you last time, dudes. If you've got any chance whatsoever to escape my beautiful farm, I know it's kind of like captivity, but it's... Oh, there we go. Oh, it's broken here as well. God damn these chickens. What are you doing? Pecking at my stone walls or something? You cannot be trusted. See, the cows never try and escape. The cows are good. The cows have chill. You dudes, zero. Zero chill. Um, so yeah, the strawberries have just come in, which is awesome, which means we can get loads and loads of money from them, which is great. I was thinking in terms of, like, what we want to do next. Um, trying to upgrade the barns would be amazing to get, like, new animals and stuff. That would be really awesome. And I kind of want to try and get through to the next season in this episode. I think that would be kind of good. Yes, keckers. Oh, it's always keckers. Go away. Let me out. Let me out of my... Oh, come on. <laughs> I can't get out. There we go. Fantastic. Uh, so yeah, this is kind of weird for me because I'm playing with a different mouse. The mouse that I was using broke and I had this like spare mouse, which is basically a horrible cheap one. Um, and it's really weird to play with. Like, it just feels so different. But anyway, what we're going to do is we are going to go and harvest these straws because these are the ones that we got from the, uh, the fair. Do you remember the fair? The, was it the Easter egg hunt? I think it was the Easter egg hunt. So that was the first one of this season. And it's pretty good because you can get strawberries from it. And these things do sell for a good amount of money. So let's harvest these guys up. All right, nearly done, I think, which is pretty good. So let's grab all of these. Uh, now, these are good because it's one of those crops, kind of like all the berries do this, but you don't have to then replant the seeds, which is fantastic, and it is super, super useful. Uh, have we got anything that we can plant in here? You know what? Let's actually plant these um, uh, blah, blah, parsnips in the spare slots for now, just to kind of get something growing. I don't think we'll have enough time to grow anything else. I'm actually not sure. So we've got a few spots over here as well. These were some parsnips which we just grabbed as well. So let's stick these down. Maybe we should try and do the potatoes. Oh man, this is so messy. <laughs> so I tried to kind of like up production this particular sort of season, but it got a little bit messy, the farm. We've got sort of random crops in random locations, but it's not too much of a big deal. It's okay. We're still getting money, which is important. So how do we do? Uh, 41 gold stars. Wow, that's a lot of gold stars. That's pretty good. Uh, 7 regulars and 26, um, silver stars. So, pretty good. That should give us a nice- Oh, look at my house! It's so pretty! And we've got some jam. Alright, okay. Sell, sell, sell. Sell it all! Sweet lady profit. Beautiful. Let's grab ourselves this jam. Let's sell the jam. Let's sell the mayonnaise. Let's sell the duck mayonnaise. That should be a very, very healthy payday when it comes in. Pretty good. So, what I want to do is I actually want to go and try and meet Penny again. Because we're doing really, really well with her. As you can see, we only need one more heart. And because it is a new week, she's due some presents. So, come on, milk the cow. Excelente. And let's see if these guys are hungry. Actually, we'll open that up for now. Uh, oh, there's no food here. Oh, I'm so sorry, dudes. 
I'm so sorry. Hang on, let me, let me help with that. Let me help with that. Let me put some of this down. Fantastic. So I'm thinking if we actually get this big payday, I want to spend it all pretty much straight away on doing an upgrade. So I'm thinking maybe either barn or house. I'm kind of thinking that the barn may be more useful because we can get like different animals and stuff. We can try and work on those bundles. Um, but yeah, okay, so let's fetch our handy dandy horse. Come here, Boris. There we go. Let's ride. Ooh, my jam's ready. Okay, so this is pretty annoying. Um, I just finished, like, well, I didn't finish. I was right in the middle, and then I noticed that my screen capture software wasn't recording. So I've been sitting here on my own like a complete sausage, talking to myself for about half an hour, playing some sweet, sweet Stardew Valley, and the screen wasn't recording. That is so annoying. Oh, man, that is annoying. The good thing is, though, the good news is I noticed just in time for a very special event, and I completely forgot this was coming, but today is the day of the flower dance. Now, if you remember back, and if you've been watching this series for a little while, basically the flower dance happened in our first ever year, and long and short of it is, no one wanted to dance with us. And I mean literally no one. It was terrible. I mean, all the girls, they didn't want to dance with us. All the guys, they didn't want to dance with us. God damn, these chickens have broken more of this. Are you kidding? Ah, not even old Fisherman Willy wanted to dance with us. And that is when you know times are hard. Because old Fisherman Willy, he dances with anyone. But nope. Not us, because everyone hated us when we moved in. Well, not really. Well, they didn't really know us, but not, not not well enough to dance with us anyway. But the good news is today is because we have been doing some serious romancing with Penny. Our time to have a dance partner is finally here. So that should be pretty cool. Um, but yeah, that's so annoying. I did like some cool stuff then as well. Oh, that's such a shame. Oh, well, never mind. We'll just carry on. So in between then, like the first bit and this bit, I've basically just been tending to my farm, which is good. We had our first crop of strawberries, which was awesome. And uh, yeah, we got 35k now, which is not that much. To be honest, I thought that these would get out the way, chickens. <laughs> You're so pesky. You know that. You know that as well, don't you? You have nothing but hate for me. God damn you all. Um, but yeah, so... Um, we did some farming and some bits and pieces, which was good. Oh, my beans are ready. Excellent. All right, let's grab these beans quickly, and then we'll go for a little dance. So, uh, yeah, I don't really know what I want to do in today's episode, to be honest, because I've kind of already recorded an episode, and now that episode is gone, and it is very sad. But what I was thinking... No, don't eat the green bean. Uh, what we could do is actually take a look and see what upgrades are available to, like, increase our farm. So... Um, we have more of the barn upgrades which we can do, which means we can get different animals, which I think would be kind of awesome. We can also upgrade our house more, and uh, yeah, now that sort of hopefully we should be able to, I guess, work on Penny a bit more. See, the thing is, she is, um, she's on nine, nine hearts right now, and in the process of the episode which I just did, I gave her two more diamonds. So I don't think we can do any more for this week. So maybe we'll power through until the next season. I think that might be a good way of doing it. But anyway, it's the flower dance. It is a beautiful time. So let's go and have a little dance with our lady. It'll be beautiful. All those hard hours down in the mines, grinding away diamonds for the one special lady. And today, we dance. Right, Eo, here we are. So... <laughs> I remember the first year I showed up here and I thought that no one else had come and I thought it was just an elaborate setup just to sausage me a bit. But you know, I think we're okay. I think people have shown up, hopefully, and they should be down here. If they aren't, there'll be some very strong words. Okay. Ooh. Okay, I remember this. So what is he selling? Top of flowers. Uh, flowers planted in an oak barrel. Blooms in the spring and summer. That's quite nice, actually. We'll buy one of those. And oh, the rare crow. Yes, we don't have this rare crow yet. So I think, how many have we got now? Five out of eight, I think we've got. No, collect them all. This is number five out of eight, but I do actually think we also have five. So we need to keep an eye on where we can get the other ones. But yeah, so this was the dance festival. We did this last year. None of these miserable so-and-sos wanted to dance with us. And I'm talking Robin here. She didn't want to dance with us. I'm talking, what's her name? Caroline. Yes, she didn't want to dance with us. I'm talking Emily. She didn't want, not even Clint trustworthy Clint didn't even want to have a boogie. Bad times. So, <laughs> anyway, let's see if Penny wants to dance with us. So, ask Penny to be your dance partner. Yes. You want to be my partner for the flower dance? Okay, I'd love to. Yes, lads, we've done it. Oh, so beautiful. 
All that hard work has paid off. Who else have we got? Can we get more than one dance partner? I'm practicing my dance moves. It needs to be perfect. Oh, Haley. I do like Haley as well. Don't get me wrong. But I think Penny's a keeper. She's marriage material. You know what I mean? So, <laughs> anyway. I think we should have a little little dance. See if we go over here. Not even George wanted to dance with us last time. How tragic was that? Flowers, I can hardly see them. Oh, I think we've bought these. You see these things around the sides? Ah... Okay, anyway, let's get this dance festival a-going. Well, should we dance the, do the dance now? Yes, we should. Let's do this. What's going to happen? Is this going to be worth it? We had to watch last year. It was quite sad. Oh, we're in the middle. And Penny's got a white dress on. Why have I not got a blue thing? Everyone else has got fancy clothes. I feel left out. This is terrible. Oh, it's so beautiful. <laughs> oh, this is so weird. Okay, so... We're in the dance festival, I don't really know what to say about it other than it's pretty cool that we actually got to do it this year because we couldn't do it last year, of course. Very good. Hmm. I feel like I should have made a bit more of an effort with my clothes. Everyone else has got, like, blue suits on? Oh, that was fun! Time to go home! <laughs> okay, fair enough, that is it for the dance festival. So, let's go to bed, and then what I'm thinking about doing is probably just trying to power through until next week, because then we can give some more diamonds to Penny, and we'll start a new season, so I think maybe that might be a good idea, because there'll be new crops and stuff, which I think would be good. Um, but okay, so the 25th of spring, what have we got? Now, I'm wondering if my strawberries are actually going to regrow in the time that we have left, because it would be awesome to get, like, another harvest, uh, but as well as that anything here. Welcome to Living Off the Land. Now listen, I'd like to talk to you about the famous Adventurers Guild near Pelican Town. Okay. As a nice reward program for anyone brave enough to slay monsters, adventurers will receive powerful items in exchange for slaying. Okay, that's cool. Um, so, have I actually been there on camera? I'm not too sure. What can I make? Oh, I can make eggs. Yes. I'm gonna make an egg. Amazing. I don't know if I've been to the Adventurers Guild on camera, but it's pretty cool. Oh, what's this? Uh, I'm going to give you this advice because I like you and I want you to stay in Pelican Town. Uh, if there comes a day that you want to ask for someone's hand in marriage, oh, you'll need to give them a mermaid's pendant. Don't worry, everyone in Pelican Town understands the significance of this amulet. It's an ancient tradition in this region. Good luck, Lewis. Oh, snap. Oh, we've done it. We've done it. Oh, this is a magical day. What's this? Meet me in the bathhouse after dark. Penny. OMGs. This just got spicy, lads. Prepare yourselves. What on earth does that mean? Meet me in the bathhouse after dark. Okay, well, you've got it, Penny. I'll be there. Ooh. This is pretty cool, right? I'm excited. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do my farming. I'm going to do my usual stuff. I'm going to go into town, buy some new clothes, smell nice, have a shower, wash my hair, and then go meet Penny. You got any advice for me, guys? Thought not. Okay, okay, okay. So I was kind of joking when I said I was going to get ready and have a shower and all that stuff, but... To be honest, we should make an, a bit of an effort, so <laughs> I thought, what a better situation than to go and buy a new hat. Wow, I hear you say, a new hat. James, can you afford this? Well, no, but we're going to make the investment because it's pretty much the only thing you can do in terms of customization. So it's going to be pretty cool. There is a hat house down here, believe it or not. It is ran by a cat. It is the cat who owns the hat shop. Amazing, right? And what have we got a choice of? So we've got a good old cap, a lucky bow. Um, the middle is made of solid gold. Ooh. Okay, pretty cool. Uh, butterfly bow, daisy, tropic lip. These are all, like, ladies' hats. Official cap, watermelon band, blue... Man, there's so many. Why are these all girls' hats? I mean, literally, they're all girls. <laughs> should we rock up in a pink cowgirl hat? <laughs> um, should we... Let's get a cool cap. Let's try and be, like, super cool in front of Penny, because that's definitely gonna work, right? Oh, yeah. Look at my hat. I'm cool. Actually, you know, this is going to give it. This makes us seem like a rebel. You know what I mean? Let's get a... Is this literally all the hats we have? This is a terrible selection. <laughs> oh, God. Um, I guess we could put a... Like, I really don't know what to pick. 
Let's buy the cowgirl hat. Does this look weird? Is this going to give the wrong imp- Nope. This is the one. This is the keeper. I feel like we've definitely made the right choice with this hat. You know what I mean? It's pretty snazzy. I don't understand, like, why are all of them, like, girls? Because obviously you can- you can play as a female character. I'm, I'm almost certain of that, so obviously that would work, but... I actually don't know. I think there's an achievement where if you collect all the hats, you get something, but I'm not too sure. Anyway, I came up here just to kind of check to see what upgrades we could maybe do next. So, what do you sell out of interest? Um, a plasma TV. Okay, that's pretty cool. So, we could get a mahusive TV. I wonder if the bigger TV would let us unlock more stuff. That might be worth looking into. But anyway, so upgrade house. What have we got a choice of? Uh, I can increase the size of your house and add a nursery. Oh! <gasps> It will cost 50,000 gold, and you will also need to provide me with 150 pieces of hardwood. No, we are not having babies yet. You jump in the gun, Robin. Stay calm, stay frosty. All right, but what else can we do in terms of this? Um, a coop, which we already have. A barn, which we already have. A well, a silo, a slime hutch, which I think actually we could af afford, to be honest. We've got refined quartz and iridium. Raise up to 20 slimes, fill water troughs, and slimes will create slime balls. Interesting. Deluxe coop, which unlocks rabbits, which we could actually do for 20k. Or big barn, which unlocks goats. So we've got a choice of basically goats or rabbits. But the big barn is cheaper. So I think what we'll do is we do have the wood. We'll go and do that. But I think we'll do that maybe... Oh, should we do it now? Yeah, I guess so. Why not, right? Ah, uh, so the one slight issue was I didn't actually have any wood, which was a bit annoying. So I've just spent most of the time here chopping down some fresh wood. We should have enough. Annoyingly, though, I accidentally chopped down one of our fruit trees. <laughs> which is, oh, it would have grown next season. I planted it right at the beginning. And it's grown lovely, lovely and big. And then I just chop it down because I'm an idiot. So um, <laughs> that's kind of annoying, but never mind. Uh, I harvested some more potatoes and uh, yeah, now it's getting dark. So I thought, oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Bear with, bear with, parsnip. There we go. Nice. So it's getting dark. We know what that time means. It means we're going to have our secret rendezvous with Penny. I'm kind of excited. Should we go to the bathhouse? Let's do it. Come on, noble steed. Let's ride. Okie dokies, here we go. So I have no idea what to expect, but uh, let's see how we do. So up we go here, and da 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 This is the bathhouse. Whew, I'm kind of nervous. Let's go. Penny? Penny? <laughs> have I been stood up? Are you in here? Oh god, I've been stood up. What? Meet me at the bathhouse. Oh, that's the woman's locker. Yeah, I know that, but where's Penny? Uh, are you just chilling in the weights room? What the? I, I, have I, have I, <laughs> and she stood me up. What? Meet me in the bathhouse after dark. Is 100% what she said. What are you doing here, dude? Oh. I snuck into the caves last night and got a nasty cut from a rock crab. Don't tell anyone, okay? What the heck are you doing? I haven't... I got an achievement, apparently. I don't really know how or why. But there we go. So where is she then? Oh, I'm so disappointed. I got all psyched. I bought a new hat. I bought this beautiful pink cowboy hat for her. I don't know what to say. I feel so heartbroken. Unless she's going to come later on. You know what? Let's wait for a little bit. Let's wait for a little bit. Let's give her the benefit of the doubt. Let's wait until midnight. Because everybody hurts. Because everybody cries. Because everybody hurts. Sometimes. She didn't come. Penny, why? Why would you do this to me? I'm so gutted. It definitely said bathhouse, right? If I've read this as like mum's house or I've read it as bathhouse, I'm going to be really annoyed with myself. She didn't come. Why? I'm gutted. I am absolutely gutted. Why didn't she come? Aww. I waited as long as I can. If I wait any longer, I'm going to black out and then lose some money. So 
Unless there's a reason why she didn't show up. I have no idea. I have no idea whatsoever. You know what? Let's go to bed because we're gonna sulk and we're gonna we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna give Penny the cold shoulder because she was supposed to show up. She said she would show up, but she didn't show up. How could she do such a thing to us? After all we've done. That's quite sad, isn't it? Oh. <laughs> okay, never mind. Well, <sighs> time for bed. Alone. Again. With my doge. Hello, doge. <sighs> all right, so how much did we get from those potatoes then? Hmm? Ooh, level nine foraging. Fantastic. I've got a rain totem. That's pretty snazzy. Okay. So, not very much from the potatoes. Hmm. The 26th of spring. Very good. I wonder, did I do something wrong then? Did I go the wrong place? There's nothing in my notebook, but my strawberries are ready. Well, okay, so ladies and gentlemen, that is going to be about it for today's episode of Stardew Valley. So thank you so, so much for watching. <sighs> She's playing hard to get, lads. I think that's all it is. Don't worry about it. We'll work on it. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, please remember to poke me in that like button before you leave uh, to show support for your series. Uh, for this series, I really, really appreciate that. Thank you so, so much. And also, if you're not yet subscribed, go for it. Because we do Stardew Valley done fun. And very lonely today. <laughs> that's so sad. Uh, but yeah, but until next time, thank you once again for watching. It's been such a pleasure. As always, thanks. Rinse up.